Hi, uh, my name is Ankit. He is Nitin and he is Abhilash. Uh, we are team number three and we are building a bot which can assist in the management of the library. What our bot, bot will do is like given a stack of the books, uh, it will just uh, categorize the book according to the which uh, section it belongs and then place these books into each section. Uh, the basic motivation of uh, this project uh, lies uh, sees when we go to uh, any of the library. When the students uh, return the book, then uh, all the uh, all the books which is needs to be arranged need to be done manually. So that uh, that requires a lot of uh, manual work. So if we are able to build uh, this project, then uh, it can be uh, or it can be very helpful in optimization. So like uh, the working of our project is like simple. Uh, we we take the camera and take the snapshot of the books and see the. And according to the QR code, we detect from which section this book belongs. Say, like we have a sample like book, like this is the QR code, uh, which will uh, which will help us in detecting the uh, which section this book belongs to. So uh, all this book will have a QR code. Uh, if this uh, this is a computer's library, then uh, uh, using the image processing, we will be able to detect that this belongs to computer section or electronic section or whatever. So using this, we will be able to detect it. And uh, the bot will be having a will be placed into an initial position. Once it is uh, set in the initial position, it will continuously monitor the books uh, books which is placed ahead of it. As soon as it detects a book, it it will just uh, t uh, categorize the book into which section it, uh, or which shelf it need to be placed. And then using that gripper arm, it will just using this gripper arm, it will just uh, uh, pick up the book uh, from that initial stack. And uh, according to the section, it will select which of these uh, box it need to be placed. And then it will just place it, and then uh, after one round trip, it will arrange itself into an initial position. So, like we can just give a demo of this, how it is working. As soon as the bot starts, it takes up the snapshot, and using the MATLAB, it process accordingly that uh, which book it belongs to. And since uh, this was the first shelf book, it will just place it into the first shelf. Once it has placed the book into the first shelf, it will just uh, go back to its initial position. And it's it just stops it there. And when now new book will come, it it's just continuously monitoring the book. If there since there is no no more book available there, it has just stops into its initial position. Like this is another book which belongs to other section. So it will just place that book into this search section. The challenges that we faced in this project was that uh, due to some hardware constraint, we were not able to do the Q, uh, QR code. Uh, the, cam the image which we are taking was not able to de decode the QR code which are present in the book. So for that, we have just used the color codes and categorized the book according, according to color code. Some other challenges were like uh, the bot uh, the bot movements need to be very, is very restricted. Like it gives a very uh, hard code. We need to do hard coding of some uh, rotations of the bot. So that's also a challenge. And the future work that we can do is like uh, we can just uh, use multiple bots, multiple bots for doing the same task. So there will be many bots doing the, the task. Some bot will be at initial position. Some bot will be placing uh, the books into this uh, shelves. One more uh, future uh, future work uh, can be that uh, obstacle detection can be taken. There can be a person moving inside the library. So the bot can uh, detect uh, whether there are some obstacle and if uh, obstacle is detected, then it can just go around that obstacle and then place the book.